What's going on, YouTube? I want to thank y'all for coming and join, joining me and cooking with me today. This is new for me. Pandemic got me doing something new. My first uh, real shot at this channel. Let's see how it goes. I'm a chef. Um, I cook a lot. I've been cooking for years now. And I figured with the pandemic and all the free time I had, I'll start something new. So on this channel, I'm gonna do try to com uh, combine two things that I like doing on my free time and in my professional life. I like to combine um, my passion for gaming and cooking all on one channel. Now, seeing that I'm fairly new to this, um, the video quality, audio and all that lovely stuff might not be the greatest, might not be up to your standards, might not be up to your par. Just give me um, give me some time, work with me, and we'll see if we can get there, all right? And I appreciate you watching my videos, coming through my channel. Any new members, please like and subscribe. Show your love. For all the subscribers so far, I appreciate you. I appreciate the love you show me so far with the little videos you've got from me. And this is just me starting up. And starting as a caveat, starting from today, um, we're gonna be doing, let's see, combining both passions. So starting next month, what I might be doing towards the end of the month is gonna be random. So I'm not gonna give you a specific time in the month that I'm gonna do this, but it's gonna be random. If you're in my city, I'm gonna do a short a video. We're gonna do a video, a short. And it's gonna be a giveaway. Now this giveaway is gonna be something um, either cooking related or it's gonna be game related. So it's gonna, I'm gonna pick a spot throughout the city and I'm gonna show a video of iconic um, buildings and place this giveaway somewhere in the spot. And if you're watching the video and you happen to find my giveaway, just uh, DM me in the comments and let me know if you found the, the, the gift, the giveaway. Let me know if you like it and support the channel. Appreciate it. Now for today, what we're gonna be doing is something home cooked, a little simple home cooking. Uh, you, see, you can see we got our vegetables, we're doing a little bit of salmon. So I think I'm gonna have to be using, I'm gonna be using my hair, my air fryer today and a little bit of the oven, just to get, get us through this. I had a long day of work today, so I just, I just wanna chill and make something simple at home. I call it simple, but some viewers you never know we got asparagus we got our brussels sprouts a little yellow zucchini we got some sweet potato we got our salmon right we got our seasoning on the side this is special i can't really tell you what this is it's top secret very top secret i could tell you but i'll have to kill you so that's my setup for today. I'm gonna go ahead and get these vegetables ready by magic and I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Cue the intro. Oh shit, wait, this video's new. This channel is new, I don't have an intro. All right, I'll be back. All right, we're back. As you can see, the vegetables are ready. All right, what I've gone and done is, let me just show you a little bit. Asparagus, I cut it down, cut off the ends a little bit. Now I could make this a little bit fancier, but like I said, long day at work. Sweet potato, I peel it, sliced it. Zucchini, sliced it. Got the Brussels sprouts, we cut it in half, clean it up a little bit. Got everything there for you. I'm just gonna season everything. Of course you can't be cooking in the kitchen without the wine, of course not. I mean, I don't need wine for this dish, but it's always good to have wine somewhere close by. 
So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna season my vegetables with a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of my special seasoning for the sweet potato. I'm just gonna do a little bit of olive oil, a little bit of salt and pepper. And we got the salmon, which I'm gonna hit with a little bit of the special seasoning as well. Honestly, I can't tell you what this is. If I tell you what this is, I might get assassinated. We're not trying to have that today. We got the oven preheated. Five for the vegetables. So I'm gonna roast them. You hear that sound? This vegetable, the oven's ready. So I'm gonna roast the vegetables. I have my uh, air fryer set up for the salmon. Put a little foil inside. It makes the cleanup easier for me. Plus, you get a crispy skin either way. Alright, back to this. So I'm gonna get that all seasoned up and I'll be back in the gym. All right, welcome back. As you can see, my vegetables are ready to go in the oven. If you're wondering why my uh, Brussels sprouts are layered some up and some down, it's because my oven is kind of weird. The way, I, the way it cooks, it's like it heats from the bottom upwards. I'm not sure not traditional like everybody else's uh, oven at home so you get more of the crispiness on the bottom than you would on the top but I'm trying to get a multicolor to multicolor going on got your sweet potato now why didn't I add the same spices as I did on here because I wanted to keep the, the natural flavor of the sweet potato I didn't want to mix it up with all the spices going on there. now for the salmon I'm keeping the skin on because I like myself a crispy uh, salmon skin. I don't know why, it's just me. <laughs> uh, season both sides. And now I'm just gonna put them, lay them in here. And we'll be back. Our veggies are in the oven. for the final dish. Something simple but flavorful. 